Hello guys, good day. That's all I'm gonna say. Um, it is Friday. We usually don't start the vlog off on a Friday, but that's what I'm doing today because it's Juneteenth and I was off of work. Shout out to my company for allowing us to be off of work. Said the camera died when we were trying to open <laughs> open the vlog. Say hello. Bye bye. No, hello. Hello. Say welcome to House of Cremel. Welcome to House of Cremel. <laughs> bye bye. Bye bye. His bye bye means hello. You got orange on my shirt. <laughs> well, well, well. Say we started on Friday. Happy well. Juneteenth. Whoa! Wow! Whoa! 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 Your daddy got you doing all of this. <laughs> okay, say hi. Sing your song. We go, we, 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 pat your tummy, something, I don't know. Ra, ra, ra. Ra, ra. And he got about that. Yeah, yeah. If you noticed, oh, small house update. We got our patio um, stained. Yep. We got it yep. power washed and stained. Yep. Uh, we wanted to make sure it was safe, so we started with getting it inspected, and then, um, what is Quintel's YouTube name? Oh, Mr. Success Over Money, yeah. I'll tag him, um, came back out to our house. It's the same guy that did our lights, installed the lights in the house, and on the outside of the house. He also um, stained our deck. He is an all-around, I don't want to call him just a fix-it guy, he's just very much capable of yeah. things around the home. He does a lot of great things. Yeah. Pretty good. He's pretty good. So, he yeah, he is. He, he does everything. He he specializes in HVAC, electrical, plumbing, stuff like that. But he does other services as well. So he's pretty good, man. Shout out to you, Quintel. That's up, right. Man? Good man. When you find a good one, you hold on to him. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, we got our deck done, so it's looking really nice out here, and um, Bookie is back to playing. Yeah. My baby likes the wheels on things. He <laughs> likes to see them spin. He's not so much into pushing them, although he will. He used to, but now he is into what's going on under the hood, <laughs> or under the whatever this is, the wheels. Yeah. Boop, boop. Look, I have a project for you. Are you interested? I just put some jello in a container. It's really not that big of a deal. But I'm trying to get him to play with it. Yeah, boop. Boop. Look. You got some jello. Yeah. <laughs> Good? This is why you can't do too much, too many sensory activities with toddlers of things that are toxic or non edible because mm -hmm. they, they put them. everything in their mouths.
<laughs> Hello hey, everyone. <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> Welcome back to House of Cremel. It is Saturday and it is a rainy Juneteenth and Father's Day weekend. Yep. Happy Juneteenth, baby. Happy Juneteenth. And happy Father's Day, baby. Thank you, baby. Hey. This is my baby's daddy. Oh yeah. I don't know if y'all can see the resemblance in him. <laughs> But I told him, uh, yeah, he did the heat of happen. Yep. <laughs> anyway, <Yep. laughs> I might cut that whole part out. <laughs> Say that, talk that. I hope you're going. <laughs> Boogie said, yep. Yeah. Yep. That's my daddy. Yeah. I got to show y'all his little first Father's Day artwork when we get back home. That was a red light. No, I know, but I was already across the front. Oh. <laughs> right. <laughs> Jesus, we out here living. Wow. Do it like me. <laughs> but I gotta show y'all Buki's first Father's Day artwork. It's the <laughs> cutest little thing. One day I was so confused. He came home with blue spots on his toenails, and I was like low key freaking out because I didn't know. I was I, I wasn't aware of the Arts and Craft project, but um, it came off. But it was more so fully explained when we got his little Father's Day. Artwork piece, so we'll show that to you later. They said they got another piece that they're working on. Something she said. Oh, yeah. Yeah. They got okay. another one. So, <laughs> this be interesting. I don't know how much Bookie got to do with that. I don't know, man. <laughs> Bookie come on with another shirt on. <laughs> right. <laughs> All kind of awesome crap. Maybe that's what happened. Mm -hmm. Probably it was handy. Paint. But we are out. We are headed to. I think first we're going to look at a mattress. And then we're going to go to dinner after that. Um, I didn't cook tonight. Such a bad wife. I'm not a bad wife. Mm -hmm. I did cook this morning. Y'all already saw the little breakfast board I did. It was good too. It was good. Mm -hmm. Simple yet fancy. Yep. Um, and now we have an official board to do our little boards on. So. <laughs> like breakfast lunchables. <laughs> 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 that was great though. <laughs> you yeah. heard movie. Yeah. Yeah. Uh oh. All that. All that. Yep. But yeah, so we're gonna go to dinner and um to a restaurant of Chuck's choosing and um, me and Bookie are treating him this weekend. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I know I'm Got me and my friends. Oh Lord, Chuck getting soft up <laughs> on now. Lord have mercy. But um, and if you're wondering why we're doing this today, it's because tomorrow we have we're plan on putting some time in with the um, the grandparents. So we're going to do a brunch with Chuck's side in the morning, and then later on in the afternoon or late afternoon, we're going to go see my grandparents. And somewhere in between there, we're going to call my dad. My dad, as you guys always know, if you've been following on the vlog, lives in Miami. Make sure you look at this vlog here if you want to see my dad and um, our trip to Florida from earlier this year. And yeah, so I guess we'll see you guys when we get to the mattress store, the, the furniture store. Your girl has been having major back pain. I am feeling all the 36 when I lay down on that mattress you hear me like I wake up with a sore back and it is not cool <laughs> <laughs> so we're looking yeah. into um it's time, for, it's, time for it's, time. it's time so we're looking into ordering a um well we were supposed to order a mattress when we bought that new bed but somehow the priorities got shifted and we just didn't and it wasn't bothering us at the time so but now it is <laughs> So hopefully we walk away with an order for a mattress today because I need it. <laughs> Something around it. <laughs> and um, maybe also a status on my couch, our couch. Yeah, we're gonna pull up on them. Couch was supposed. We ordered this couch in December, and it's not here yet. And we thought we were gonna have it by mid June, and the date just keeps getting pushed back. If you're ordering furniture right now during the time of Post COVID, during COVID, post COVID, whenever, then you already know the struggle. Bless your heart. 
so we're just waiting on our new couch which we actually do now desperately need because the current one is peeling <laughs> <laughs> but um yep yeah, so i guess we'll see you guys when we get in the furniture store oh you cute too i don't want to say that oh thank yeah, you real delicious over there <laughs> <laughs> we found our mattress and we actually got our table too ooh, ooh. but somebody acted a whole fool in the furniture store that's why he down here looking at coco melon <coughs> so we can get through this transaction And then hopefully we get to go to dinner after this. Oh, guys. <laughs> well, as you saw, we went to the furniture store. <clears throat> we did get a mattress. Yay. And uh, we actually also got a table. I think I said that while I was in there. The salesman was with us, so I wasn't really filming a lot, talking to her. But we were going to go to dinner. But my little precious back there, who you see is falling asleep, fell apart slowly. And, um, <laughs> and also the restaurant that we was going to go to, the wait is just too long. It got to be too much of a wait. And um, so we're just going to head back home since Book is sleeping. It's almost time for him to eat dinner anyway. And I'm going to pick something up. And we're going to be in for the night. And um, we may try this dinner thing again tomorrow. I don't know. But let's see what we, uh, what, we what happens when we get home. It's raining so bad right now. I guess it's not that bad, but it's raining, so. Yeah. What's up, y'all? We're home, thank God. Got to be a little touch and go there. We're all really hungry. Yep. We ended up getting <laughs> wings. <laughs> it's a delicacy, you know? I mean, I'm trying to lay Susan towards you a little bit. Me? Yes, you. <laughs> oh, you need wings the business. Goodness. Well, wings is one of Chuck's favorite foods. Yep. Always has been, always will be. Mm-hmm. So he doesn't have a problem trading in his fancy dinner for a 10 piece. Or in our case, what is this, a 20 piece or 40 piece? <laughs> That's more than 10. <laughs> Ah, happy Father's Day weekend. Buki over here eating. Uh... Say hi. Got his dinner. As you saw, he took a little nap in the car. I like this. We got to This is a magnificent <laughs> I got y'all set up on my lady Susan on the table, so it's kind of nice. But yeah. I'm kind of glad we didn't go to the restaurant because an under nap baby can cause problems. Mm -hmm. And we were already those parents in the furniture store. <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea how dinner would have went. Sometimes you got to make those calls and you just got to go home. And um, yep. do what you gotta do. Got to. And we are happy. <laughs> oh yeah. Part of being a parent, part of being a father. Mm-hmm. Fathering on Father's Day, Father's Week, Father's Day weekend. Hey, you do one day, man. It's one time, every day thing. Absolutely. What is your favorite part about being a father? Oh, uh, even had me in my feelings. No, okay. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
Um, I will say my favorite thing is <clears throat> I get a chance to see another copy of myself. <laughs> <laughs> like it's so crazy to see him grow up and he got both of our personalities, which is crazy. Yeah. <laughs> and then, you, but you see a, a kid and you actually raising a child, like it, it's kind of, I don't know, it's kind of surreal. I gotta, I gotta pinch myself sometimes and say, man, you really a, a whole dad out here. Mm-hmm. Like, you ain't daddy. Yeah. And for me, I think for me and Chuck, it does be mm -hmm. like that sometimes because I guess you will, I, I, do we qualify as later in life parents? I think so. We laid on. We did, cause I have I gave birth to Buki when I was. Bless you. Bless you. Bless you. Bless you. Was I 34, 35? Were you pregnant? Huh? Were you pregnant? I guess when I gave birth to him. 34. I was 34. Cause then I turned 35 that year and I'm 36. Mm. I yeah. turned 30. Yeah. So I mean, it really depends on what you define it as, but. We were definitely in the later classes, if you will, of people in our same age of um, having children. Mm -hmm. And I mean, we weren't by ourselves in that, but definitely don't regret it. Mm -hmm. For sure. Because there was a point in time, well, I think both of us didn't know if <coughs> children were actually going to happen for us. This was before we got together. But um, being a parent is a blessing. It is a job. It's one of the toughest jobs. Toughest jobs in the world. Like that, people aren't lying or overestimating when they say that. But it's also one of the most rewarding jobs in the world. Mm -hmm. Sometimes people say it can be a thankless job. I really think that comes when children get older. <laughs> but. It's just really cool to see him growing up and learning stuff and saying new words. You got a whole thing of fries right here, man. Yeah. You don't want those? Oh, okay. <laughs> so yeah, it's just cool. I'm sorry. I think I feel like I took over your speech. No, you didn't go on in there, bro. <laughs> uh -huh. You hit all the spots. I'm over here hitting this chicken wing right now. <laughs> Hello. Oh yeah, soon it'll be time for, I don't think he like wing stop french fries. <laughs> no, there's a... Mm-mm, he's been them out. Maybe something was overcooked. Look at him. <laughs> he look like me when I don't like something. He like... He trying. But pretty soon it'll be time for Boogie to go to bed. I might wait a little bit later. Since he took that little mini nap in the car. But we gone. Mm -hmm. Oh! What? <laughs> you okay? Yeah. This is the Father's Day card that Charles made for his dad at that Look year. at what the hammer is. It's his, <laughs> it's his little foot. Oh lord. His little big pudgy foot. He has the cutest little foot. But yeah, I wanted to show this to y'all. <laughs> I think we got Buki and Daycare. <coughs> Excuse me. He got in daycare too late for me to get a Mother's Day gift. I think we was, it was just right after that, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Look, you want look, drink? Just, look what just takes me. So, uh, super Rico. Damn, it's been two hours. It's, two, cool. it, it's a wait, seventy five. It's an hour and a half. No, it wouldn't have made that one. The table that we would have had at Super Rica just became available. Hour and a half later. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> Die. I got another one. Hold, please. And we're back. 
with a full battery. Yeah. Oh gosh. <laughs> It is Sunday and it's still raining. Yeah. But we're headed to Chuck's parents' house for a little Father's Day brunch. Bookie is dressed. He's back there. Oh, I can't see what he's doing. We will. We got the first round on him. Yep. Oh gosh. <laughs> but yeah, we're headed there. Didn't eat breakfast this morning. Well, Boo Boo's the only person that ate breakfast this morning because nobody has time to see what that looks like. <laughs> but uh, I'm hungry, Chuck's hungry, so I think we're both excited to eat. Yep. So hopefully we'll see you guys when we get over there. Happy Father's Day. Happy Father's Day. Are you having a good Father's Day weekend? I'm having a great weekend, man. Great weekend. What's your favorite part so far? I mean, I got a lot of different favorite parts. My favorite part, and the highlight, we know the Braves game. I really enjoyed it. We had hot wings last night, so I'm, <laughs> I'm a happy guy. You know what I'm saying? I can, I can do the fancy restaurants and all that, but I'm a, you know, hey. He's going to say he's a simple guy. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> good night. Good night. Good night. Bye, y'all. <laughs> He said bye y'all, so I guess we gotta go. Anyway, y'all ain't gotta go. Y'all ain't, yeah, you know. I guess I gotta go. I'm saying bye to you. Good night. Good night. All right, we'll see y'all when we get over there. Yay! Yay! Oh, hey, oh. oh. Chop me. <laughs> okay. There you go. Yay! Yeah. You got it? Watch out, watch, watch your head. head. Bye bye. Bye bye. Oh, that fruit salad look good. <clears throat> oh, I'm gonna switch his cup. Okay. Cause he uh, he gonna just shake that one. Oh, okay. <laughs> so we you buy him the other one. You got it. You got it. You got it. For uh, <laughs> what is grits? Uh -huh. Ooh. So y'all, back at home right now. Buki is with his grandparents at his grandmother's request. So me and Charles, we, we the plan today was brunch, and you know whatever, whatever happened, you know, we don't like to make too tight a plan sometimes, cause you know just kind of want to go with the flow. But they wanted to be alone with their grandchild, so that's what's happening. <laughs> So, um, yeah, I think later on when we go pick him up, we'll take him by to see my grandfather. I already called my dad today. He was actually going to work. Um, he told my son, they don't, um, they don't care. I'm going to leave out the words he did say, but my daddy cuss a lot. But he told my son, they don't give a about being father. I said, oh, they, they send granddaddies to work on Father's Day. But, um. Yeah, his card is coming in the mail for him. Sent him some pictures of uh, his grandchildren, some that we have. And yeah, so I guess we chilling right now for a little while. And um, that's all I really got for you. About to get into some leftovers because I'm hungry again. And me and Chuck just gonna enjoy the quiet in the house. It's still raining. It's quite wet in Atlanta. I think I already said it in the car. So, yeah, I like to stay in the house when it's raining. I do. I don't like to do too much when it's raining. I do some things, but not too much. It's wet, traffic. People in Atlanta don't know how to drive. All you need to do is add water. You don't even need to add water to Atlanta traffic in order to experience the worst of it. So, rain just puts it on 10. So, just like to chill at home. Um, if I haven't said it already, happy Father's Day to all the fathers and father figures out there. We love you. We appreciate you. And, um, just keep doing what you're doing because it matters. Um, y'all like my hair? Trying something new, you know, actually doing it. <laughs> Got a little eyebrow on. Who is this girl? 
I don't know. Y'all might see more of her. I don't I may have figured something out uh, with my hair. We'll see. I just did a little loose flexi ride set. It wasn't like a like a tight tight set. It's like rolling up on rollers except flexi rides. I washed my hair, just put a little setting lotion on it, and I put some oil on it when I um unrolled it. And then last night I didn't put as many flexi rides as I did when I set it. But um, I did want to smooth it out just a little bit. So I used a little, um, what was it? The Miel Hawaiian Ginger Hair Butter Moisturizer. I used that before I put it on a couple of um, Flexi Rides and went to bed. And it still turned out pretty curly. So I'm happy with it. Yep. All right, I'm about to eat. I'll holler child in a minute. You don't talk no more. It needs some batteries. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Big boy. Yeah. When they can't even know you be driving. Oh, goodness. Lester. You said that was your car. Yeah. 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 Ye